In this video, I will provide you with a couple of different ways you can attach a stairway to a deck where you do not have a structural support. And you could always design the stairway so that you do have a structural support if that will work for your project. However, if it will not and you have a situation like this, then you could either install a beam and maybe use some type of an inverted hanger at the other side or set the beam on top of the post. And to do something like that, you would just simply miter the corner of this beam and this beam here or look for another way to do that so that you would have a nice solid structural support for the stairway. And instead of a beam, you could always add another two by or another piece of lumber that would be the same thickness as your deck joist. And then you could nail the stringers through the back of the joist and add either some one by or some two by, maybe a two by four connector board like we have here to connect the two boards together to again provide you with some structural support along with some building hardware and instead of using lumber you might be able to use some hardware maybe some straps or even some thicker metal quarter inch thick that you might be able to use maybe one on each side or even just one on one side where you would drill some holes through the lumber and use bolts to connect the two boards together and of course you could always use a smaller board i see this a lot and even though a structural engineer might not approve something like this i've seen every type of assembly in this video built a variety of different ways that seem to work just fine however i'm also not about to suggest that all of these connection methods in this video will work for every type of outdoor project. And of course the old plywood connector, I have seen this plenty of times, even though it's my least favorite in this video, because if this plywood delaminates or comes apart within a few years or even a few decades, I would hate to be the person who's using the stairway when it does. And in this example here, simply going to nail the upper section of the plywood to your deck joist and the lower section to the stair stringers. And I did draw a piece of treated plywood in here if that's going to work better for your outdoor deck. And of course we cannot forget the building hardware even though these are just simply straps nailed to the back of the stair stringer and to the front of the deck. Some hardware manufacturers do provide special types of building hardware to solve this particular problem. So that also might be another suggested assembly method you could use. And I would also like to point out that if you only have a few steps, maybe two or three, four or five at the most, then some of these methods might work a little better than if you have a longer stairway or a stairway that's going to be located in a high traffic area. That's actually going to require a stronger structural connection. And that's what we're going to be looking at here. And the last one in this video. And all I'm going to do here is run the stair stringer under the deck joist if the deck joist isn't too large. This might not work with a 2x12. And of course, if you do have a 2x12, you might not have this problem anyway. So if you are using 2x6 or 2x8 deck joists, then you might be able to use this method here. And this is one that I like because you can use the exterior fascia board or the front of the deck, sides of the deck, as the last riser. You're going to be able to nail the joist into the stringers, toenail the stringers into the double joist, or end nail the stringers from the other side before you install this joist here. And hopefully that makes sense. However, if it does not feel free to list any questions you have in the comment area and I will try to answer them as soon as possible.